<laughs> hey guys, what is going on? This is iAppleGeek, and today I want to show you guys how to install Cydia Extender on your iOS 10 jailbroken device without a paid developer certificate. That means if you're just an ordinary user like me, you don't have to pay to get this app. And in case you don't know what Cydia Extender is, it basically is Cydia Impactor on your device. It allows you to re-sign applications that Apple normally would not allow you to sign. So things like Game Boy emulators or the Yangu app for the jailbreak, this will work for. You do have to be jailbroken for this and I will have that process up here. Anyways, this process is extremely simple. So you don't need to have any weird coding or you need to hack into your device whatsoever. You don't need to. And I trust that most of you are jailbroken. So go ahead and just hit the Cydia app icon. We're gonna come in here and install a new source. I'm gonna go ahead and put this source in the description so you guys can just copy and paste. And once you guys come into Cydia, you hit sources, edit, add, and add the source that I mentioned. And once your source is added, go ahead and go to the search bar and we're gonna look for extender installer. And here you can see some of the details for this package. Automatic re-signing is a feature that I have confirmed to work on my device. So basically how this works is when you install something from your computer on Cydia Impactor, the certificate will expire in seven days. So what Cydia Extender does is automatically renew those applications as long as you're connected to the internet and it will basically allow you to keep the applications that Apple doesn't want you to keep on your device. Anyways, with that out of the way, let's go ahead and install Cydia Extender. Confirm. All right, I'm gonna restart my springboard and we're back. And you can see the Cydia Extender icon right there. And here is Cydia Extender. So once you're in this app, you can go to the Installed tab. This will show you the applications installed on your device from Cydia Impactor from your computer. Now I do have to note, I believe the maximum number of certificates you can install is three or four. Let's just say three to be safe, but you can only install so many applications with a normal Apple ID using Cydia Impactor. So definitely be careful what you install because if you have too many, it will not allow you to keep some of the old ones like the Yahoo app and you do not want to lose your Yahoo app because you're jailbroken. So what you wanna do if you wanna re-sign this, as you guys can see, this was re-signed yesterday or two days ago. So I just wanna hit re-sign and this prompt will come up to hit re-sign here and put in your Apple ID. And once you've put in your Apple ID, you guys can see that there might be some sort of errors that come up and you can see them in your notification center as well. But this should be normal the first time you log in to Cydia Extender. So just refresh the page by going back and forth. And if this doesn't change, that means it, it did not successfully resign. And by the way, if it keeps giving you this fail to resign with error, really weird error here, um, the way that I would go about approaching this error is to just re-sign the Yahoo app or whatever app this says here on your computer again. You may have to do this a couple times because Cydia Extender right now is not really updated and functioning as it should, as Sarek intended it to be. And this is a modified version so that you wouldn't have to use a developer certificate. But that also means it breaks a few things in the process and it may give you those weird errors. If you keep getting uh, error repeatedly and you can't solve it by redoing it on your computer, then go ahead and leave a comment down below. I will take a look at it. Anyways, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Hope this helped. And until next time, peace.